Campus Speaker of the Year and has been requested in over 300 campuses. He is the author of Living College Life in the Prep Row, a three-time ultra-marathon runner, those are 50 plus miles, um, the host of the Front Row Factor podcast, and the founder of the Front Row Foundation. Which I'm amazed by what you're capable of. You know, I'm inspired by your stories. A day of pain is worth a lifetime of pride. A day of pain is worth a lifetime of pride. Like, are you putting it all out there? See, living a front row life is literally level 10, 100% all in. If I offered that up and said, if you hit that big goal or dream, but you do it in half the time that you originally had thought even, I will, I will give you a billion dollars and save a billion children's lives. How many of you would internally say, I would change my plan, I would work harder, I would do something more courageous, I would be more bold, I would change something about my debt? How many of you say, yes, that would change things? Let's go, oh yeah. So Jesse, I'm gonna let you use my mic. Okay. All right, can you give Jesse a uh, quick round of applause here? It's Jesse! Jesse, why are you here? Um, I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes when I was 2, and I got a lot uh, involved with advocacy as a child, and I worked a lot with uh, biomedical engineers and scientists, and um, I was really um, a direct recipient of that technology, and because of all of the advancements, I was able to be as successful as I want to be. Like, diabetes does not stop me. And my goal is to be a biomedical engineer to help other kids and other people with illnesses or conditions where they, they can't be all that they can be. They're, they're limited. They can't learn from their illness. They can't be stronger. And that's really what I want to do. Awesome. Round of applause for Jesse. Thank you. I got to start living now, right? But it's like if we're, if the average age, uh, you know, average lifespan is 100 and somebody comes and says, you're going to, it's, it's over at 30, you're like, I got to get busy now. You can't, you must, and then it hits me, right? If we say in life, I can't do that, that's a thing we got to go do right now. 100% a breeze. What he means by that is, if you're only 99% in, that's actually really hard. But when you're 100% in, that's when it becomes easier.